All right, I went to Toys R Us today and uh, finally found these uh, Gears of War 2 figures. Um, we have here Scourge, uh, Cantus, the Boomer, and uh, Cock Soldier. And the uh, first one I'm going to review would be this guy, um, Scourge. So uh, stay tuned. All right, here it is, uh, Gears of War 2, uh, Scourge in packaging. That's what it looks like. And on the side, it shows a picture of him. And on this side, a close-up of his face. And uh, here's what the little bio reads. If you guys want to read it, you're welcome to pause it. I basically, I actually took the uh, the back paper out uh, just so there aren't any glare. So here's the two pictures. The double-bladed chainsaw staff. And here are the rest of the figures. Alrighty. And uh, yep, let's get on with the review. And here's what the figure looks like from the front. As you can see, and uh, when it comes in, uh, it comes out of packaging, um, the staff is uh, detached, so you have to put them together yourself. Where's the end piece? Hold on one second. All right, um, I just uh, tweeted to uh, Nick uh, to see if uh, they could answer my question because uh, I think um, the ones I have here is either uh, either a um, duplicate of the two same pieces or or supposed to have a connector because uh, right now I have two uh, female pieces. And uh, I don't know if one of them is supposed to be a male and one of them is supposed to be a female, so they would connect together, or they're supposed to be a, a, a little uh, small rod for me to connect the two pieces together. But uh, as of right now, this is what I have, and I can't connect the two pieces together. But it's not that big of a deal because I could always make my own little connector. It's not that big of a deal. But uh, here's what the figure looks like from the front. And I must say, this is a really, really nice figure. Because, uh, oh yeah, I'll go over the articulation. It's really good. This thing got really good articulation. And now uh, here's the side view. Here's the back. And I picked it up at uh, Toys R Us today. Today is uh, Thursday. And I'm, uh, I'm on the West Coast, so... For well, anyone who are uh, waiting for these things. Alright, here's a close up at his, uh, at, uh, its face, I guess. I wonder if the helmet is removable. One second, let me check. Alright, helmet is not removable. And, uh, head is on a ball joint. Shoulders are actually ball joint. And then, the bicep, there's a swivel right there, which is kind of cool. And then uh, the elbows are ball hinged, and the wrists are swivel, and uh, the armor, the outer armor itself, the gauntlet, uh, does not move because it's uh, glued to the forearm there. So when you move his uh, wrist, that's, this piece will not move with it. And then there's a ball jointed um, chest, and then the legs, they are ball jointed, because there's a ball joint up there. And, uh, the armor cover, uh, this armor right here, the thigh armor, is made out of soft plastic. And uh, no uh, no thigh swivel. There's a ball hinged um, uh, knees and uh, ball jointed ankles. That's, uh, got lots of detailing going on there. This thing is amazing. So I got a response back from uh, uh, NECA, and um, uh, so instead of uh, me missing a piece, uh, basically you just need to pull one of these uh, end caps off, off of the staff itself, and then you could attach it to the other one. So that's kind of cool, and uh, this thing is a bitch to take off. Oh my god, so it's on there so tight. So yeah, so basically you just remove this half. And then leave the other one on, and then you can attach the staff on there. So I'm going to do that and uh, show you guys what it looks like. Alright, and uh, once you have it all together, it will look like this. Which is really cool now. 
And another look at his face. And uh, here you have it. This is the Scorch. Love this figure. Can say more about it. Um, anyone? It's, uh, yeah. So here's another look all around. Thigh armor. It's uh, made out of soft rubber. So it's the the shin pad. It's also made out of soft rubber. And the loin cloth. It's also made out of soft rubber. And um, the thing behind is uh, calves. That armor is also soft rubber. And, uh, wow! Just look at that back. It's uh. It's kind of hollowed out a bit too, so really nice. Nice figure all around. Very impressed with it. NECA, their customer service is really good. I mean, I tweeted that thing like um, seven minutes ago and I already got a response. So, wow. That's really good. So now the staff is uh, perfect. Very nice indeed. Let's do a size comparison. And here's a nice size comparison. We got the Duke, uh, Bucky, uh, Bruce Wayne, and Scorch. As you can see, well, if you already have any Ghost War figures, you know exactly how tall they are. So, yeah, very nice figure. I definitely must buy for any Ghost War fans. And, uh, yeah. That's it. Thanks for watching. Here's the Kankus. Here's the Cock Soldier. And here's the Boomer. And, uh, yep. That's it. Thanks for watching.